And if you want to learn impromptu speaking, it's a very difficult skill set to learn because there's not that many people speaking about it. So if you want to learn the skill set and you're really serious about it, then you're going to have to learn from different people out there. Uh, and one field that you can learn a lot from is from hip hop. Now with hip hop, there's two groups that often form. People who uh, read off their raps and other rappers that are freestylers. So one time uh, there was an experiment done about the difference in brain states of someone who is reading off their rhymes versus a freestyler. And the person who's freestyling, the sense of self portion of the brain is completely deactivated, which means that they're tuning into this infinite sea of potential and they're turning the probabilistic insights into particle-based reality, such as the words. And I'm like, that's impromptu speaking. A lot of the times, like the cheat code to creativity is not preparing. It's like when you're preparing too much, now you're engaging the logical self. You're second guessing yourself a lot. But when you're doing impromptu speaking, it's straight courage. Because sometimes you're over here starting something, right? And you're starting it in a certain way where you're like, okay, I don't know where the hell I'm going with this, but I can't stop. I got to just keep going with it and expect that it's going to eventually connect. And if you keep keep it up, it is eventually going to connect. And once you're done with the talk, you're like, how the hell did that happen? I mean, I didn't plan it out. It just sort of happened. And that's when you're starting to see some similarities between you and the freestyle rapper. It's like the sense of self portion of the brain is disconnected. You are becoming the instrument to something and that is leading to intuition and insights.